Hello, my name is Martez Loren, and this is my 21 week update on testosterone. Um, my voice has lowered a little bit, um, but part of that is because I have a cold, so it's not just because I have magical transgender powers. My voice is just deepening at the second. I have a little bit of a cold or something right now, my throat's a little congested, so part of that is definitely for me being sick. Um, let's see. Um, this weekend was homecoming at my school that I attended college at. Um, so I've been drinking quite a bit and screaming and acting a fool. So of course, that could also contribute to my vocal cords being a bit more strained than usual. Um, as far as facial hair goes, I've got these really two annoying, sorry, got crumb there. <laughs> I got these two annoying hairs, like one on this side, you can kind of see me pulling it. It's long as shit, actually. Uh, one there and one here. Find that one. Anyway, there's one on each side, and like for some reason they're growing in curly. So I have a curly mustache growing in, so it's growing into my mouth, and I'm trying to get them out of my face because it's annoying. Um, I also have hairs here, a bit more. I'm getting a couple back here. I got like two random ones on my face on this side. And like this section is still darkening on both sides. As you can kind of see, still getting acne. That's the thing that's happening. I'm using cleansing things and like it's clearing up, but it's still there because two weeks is not long enough for acne to go away. So I'm gonna have scars, which is gonna be great. Um, the name change thing. Um, I actually didn't get a chance to go through with that yet. I actually ended up missing the uh, clinic this month, so hopefully I can talk to someone from next month and make plans to actually be attending said training. Um, passing, still get served. I still get mammed and miss and lady. That's, that's always fun. Um, one thing people don't know about me is that um, when I go out to parties or clubs and dancing, I'm not very like particular of who I dance with. Like if I'm at a club and there's a guy, I will dance with dudes. I'm not like, gonna bend over twerking for him and give him all I've got. <laughs> but I will dance with dudes. Um, and that brings me to my next topic. Um, gender identity and sexuality are not connected like you think they are. A lot of people seem to be under the impression that being transgender, like because I was born biologically female, and now I transition to be male, then I must be attracted to women because I only want to be a man because I like women. Wrong. It's actually very inaccurate and very close-minded, to be perfectly honest. Um, there are plenty of trans people, trans women and trans men, who choose to date people of opposite gender of themselves. So there are trans guys that date both trans men and cisgender men. And again, if you don't know what cisgender is, that would be, I guess, what you consider a regular person. Regular people. So there are people who are transgender, who trans men who date other trans men who or who date cisgender men. There are also uh, cisgender, there are also transgendered women, so trans women who date cisgendered women and trans women as well. And people who are bisexual, they date both men and women. People who are pansexual, who don't really care what you really have going on, they're attracted to who you are inside. And people think that's the same as bisexual, but that's a whole different topic for a whole other time. Um, then there's like a, what? Gender queer. And I'm pretty much under the impression that gender queer kind of just, they like who they like. And uh, I want to miss anybody. Leave anybody off. If I miss anybody, please don't be upset. I'm not trying to discount anybody's lifestyle or anybody's preferences. Just trying to cover the bases here. But um, I guess I say all this to say that when you see a trans man or a trans woman, please do not assume that they are attracted to the opposite sex. Because all, a lot of times that's a misinterpretation of who they want to be. Please listen to people when they tell you who they are and don't assume you know them or their life. I was actually told by a gentleman that I wasn't really transgendered, that I was saying I was transgender. I was a lesbian who just wanted to be 
seen as not being gay anymore. So I was saying I was transgendered. So that uh, what was it? So that now I'm considered a man. So it's considered okay. Little does he know, I don't give a fuck about his personal biases with my life, cause it's my life. Um, I'm a Turtle fan, by the way, so I do like a lot of cartoon shirts. If you have any, please send me some. I'd love to get the t-shirts. Um, let's see. Uh, oh, someone asked me about, I guess my last video, commented and asked if I was happier now. Um, I guess. I mean, as I'm happy with who I am as a person. I'm happy with my career completely. Not where I want to be. I'm happy with my living situation. It's okay. I have my finances, not so much. But when it comes to my gender identity and uh, the way my body is developing, I'm happier with that. Oh, another thing I have mentioned is my hands have gotten bigger. And you probably can't tell from this because I really, I really don't like show my hands very often. They're not like paws or anything, but like... They're, this is not a wedding ring, um, but they're like they're bigger than they once were. So like I've noticed at work, especially I have to wear bigger gloves. Um, my feet are bigger, and although I haven't noticed enough in the summertime to wear a lot of sandals, I'm noticing that as the winter comes back, I'm gonna have to wear like closed shoes, and I might have to buy new shoes because I know some of my shoes are a little tighter. So my feet have gotten bigger. Hopefully, I get taller because I'm five four. And I don't want to be a dude at 5'4". It's not fun. I mean, there are plenty of short guys in the world, and there's plenty of short trans guys, but I kind of wanted to be a little taller, like a little bit. I'm not saying I want to be like 8'12". That's not a real height, by the way. But I did want to be a bit taller. Like 5'9 would have been nice. Impossible, but would have been nice. Um, again, thank you guys for all your support. Uh, I still get random uh, text messages, Facebook messages, and people who contact me privately and say that they enjoy my videos and they're glad that I record. So thank you for watching. I'm Martez Loren and uh, stay tuned.